PLS, pick up the count on your mark. PLS copies. Three, two, one, mark. PLS is go for orbiter APU start. BLT, OTC, perform APU start. Copy that, in work. CDR, OTC, reconfigure heaters. CD, CDR, copy, heater, reconfigure, in work. NOTC, heater reconfigure is complete. Copy. T minus 4 minutes, 30 seconds. Pilot Lindsay will report back when the APUs have, he's seen an indication they have a good start. OTC, PLT, APU start is complete, train the grain. Copy that. T minus four minutes and counting. Four. Final purge sequence of the main engines will begin in about 30 seconds. The orbiter flight control systems are being moved through their pre-programmed pattern and they will be verified they are ready for launch. The three main engines are being gimbaled and positioned for launch. All systems are go for launch at this time, just a few minutes away from the 25th voyage of Discovery with a crew of seven. Again, this was the issue we described earlier. This is a known condition. It's just an indicator that uh, was providing inaccurate data. Clear caution and warning memory. Verify no unexpected errors. Copy that and work. MTD, CFC. MPS engine 2 pitch, actuator profile, verified nominal. CLC is go for launch. And CLC is NTD, I copy, go for launch. STE? STE is go. It's break, break, NTD, SRO on 212. Go ahead, SRO. Yes, sir, uh, we will need to hold the caution. Range is no go. We have a fouled range. I copy that, and we'll hold at T minus 31 seconds, and be advised our hold time there is 5 minutes and 18 seconds. Range understands hold time of 5 minutes, 18 seconds. OTC, PLT, caution, warning, clear, no expected errors. Stop. Countdown clock will be holding. The superintendent of range operations announced there is. Uh, remove the hold in association with our engine two pitch and insert a hold at T minus 31 seconds due to the range. PLS copies and work. Flight crew OTC, close and lock your visors, initiate O2. And on this uh, historic mission, let the winds of discovery lift us onto the future. And CDR copies, we'll close our visors and go to pseudo 2. Countdown clock will hold at T minus 31 seconds due to NTD hold request. Break, break, NTD, SRO on 212. Go ahead, SRO. Yes, sir, range is go for launch. The range is clear. I copy that, launch director NTD. Let's go. And GLS, please remove the hold at T minus 31. Copy and work. T minus one minute and counting. All systems are go. All systems have been reported go for launch of Discovery. Less than one minute away now from the historic return of John Glenn to space. I copy and attention all stations. The countdown clock will continue. Let's go for auto sequence start. Discovery's onboard computers now have control of vehicle functions. T minus 20, min 20 seconds. T minus 15. T minus 10, 9, 8, 
We have a go for engine start. Five, four, three, two, one. Booster ignition and liftoff of Discovery with a crew of six astronaut heroes and one American legend. Houston Discovery, roll program. Roger, roll, Discovery. One minute and 50 seconds into the flight, Discovery now at an altitude of 25 miles, traveling at a speed of 2,900 miles an hour. The next event will be burnout and separation of Discovery's twin solid rocket boosters. Discovery Houston, two-engine banjo. Copy, two-engine banjo. 